you are going to learn how can we insert multiple row using sql command in the previous video i explain you how can we insert multiple data in our table using sql command but the problem is we need to add data one by one suppose we need to insert five row in our table in that case we need to run this sql command for five time first we need to execute for add one then we need to execute for smith and similarly we need to execute for sophia and emma so we have to run the insert command every time when we want to add a row it's a very lengthy process but we can cover it in a single step using this insert command we can add multiple row at once let's see the syntax how it's work you can see on your screen first we need to use insert command key insert into our table name and then we need to define the columns name and we need to use another keyword values then you need to take a round braces for the information you want to add in your columns and we need to follow the same order and then you need to use comma and similarly you can take another row of data and you can add a new record in this process you can take multiple row of data and at last you need to use semicolon to end this command so let's see the practical how can we use insert command to add multiple row of data so i am back to my mysql workbench application and i also open xamp control panel and before run the mysql workbench application we need to start xamp localhost server first i am going to start apache server and then i am going to start mysql and then i am waiting for green signal now it's ready for connection let's connect it so i'm going to hover on my connection name demo and double click on it and you can see on your screen we can connect our connection perfectly in our schema section you can see our database names and also you can see my tables name personal and product let's see what we have in our personal table so i'm going to hover on table icon and click on it and you can see there is one row of data which we insert in our previous video name advan minj date of birth 1995 and gender is male and now i am going to add three record at once in this table using insert command so i am back to my query one section first i am going to type insert keyword insert into our table name personal and then i'm going to use round braces inside the round braces we need to type our columns name our first column is id our second column is name and our third column is birth underscore date comma our fourth column is phone and our fifth column is gender and then i type another keyword values in the next line i'm going to take another round braces and we will insert the data the way we took the column name so first i'm going to insert our id value 2 then name smith comma date of birth 1991 october 6 and for phone number i'm going to type some random numbers and for gender i'm going to type capital m and we need to use comma because we are going to add another row so i duplicate this line and now i am going to change the values id 3 name anna date of birth 1997 october 9 and for phone number once again i am going to type some random number and for gender i am going to type capital f once again i duplicate our previous line and i am going to replace value for id I type four. For name, I'm going to type Ravi, and birth year is 1990. But for phone number, I'm going to use the similar phone number. I'm going to explain you in the next video why I choose similar phone number. And for gender, I type capital M. And at the end, we need to use semicolon to end this command. So our command is complete. Now it's ready for execute. Let's execute the command. So I'm going to hit thunder icon. You can see in my action output section 
it's written green signal it's mean it's execute perfectly and if i back to my personal table and run this command once again you can see the new data so you see how we insert lot of data together thanks for watching this video see you on the next tutorial press the bell icon and subscribe the youtube channel get sight man if you like this video don't forget to like comment and share this video with your friend i will see you guys in my next video